What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. This is Carlissa's reaction after she left the jail um, yesterday. Well, excuse me, was kicked out. When I tell y'all this is too much, baby, it's too much. We know, we all watch. I don't it. think none of y'all could handle none of this. Now, I just walked in here to the court out and got kicked out. I got everything on the six out. Go subscribe to watch the whole thing. How convenient to record, y'all. I was not present. I didn't see the. I didn't see her leaving the handcuffs. I think that's some up sh for both the parents to be in jail right now. But most craziest, sh I just seen my son in court looking like old dog from Minister Society. <laughs> <laughs> And it just, it, it, it crushed me 12, 22 in the jet to my core. I cried. I got kicked out. It's, I'm kicked out. Everybody's still in there. It's just, this is when I say this too much, this too much. At this point, all the elders need to get that ghetto done got too ghetto, huh? In and try to help figure this out. Cause this is too much. This too much for any parent, this too much for any person. Now, both the baby parents is in the jail. Both of them. I, I did bring the video At the same damn time. I mean, just how in the hell did that happen? Cameras, because I talked to Wack and he's, you know, he got a good attorney and he said it was a slam dunk. So I was, you know, hoping to come get some nana -na boo boo footage some footage of you know my son maybe coming home today or possibly tomorrow whatever the case may be so i did bring the cameras because i got a heads up but i did not know that i was coming into this type of this type of it don't even make no kind of sense it don't even make no kind of sense i'm not gonna try to bash john's daddy for not wanting to take the baby I, they got me saying, I, I, agree, I said, I'll take the baby. Me and Marsh are locked eyes, and she said, don't worry, Carlissa, I got the baby. I told her, please just wait for my son to come, come in the courtroom with the baby and let my son tell you what he wants you to do with the baby. That, that's all. If I was Marsh, I would have just took him. Because Blueface probably would have said, give him to the daddy because he know he at the house, but I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe that might have changed because um, Krishan ain't going to be there for right now. So who knows? All I asked her to do tomorrow on the Patreon for y'all to see because I knew they was going to go try to chop it like we didn't want the baby. Everybody that was there today, I even think at one point Jaden looked up like she would take the baby. We wasn't no type of people. Y'all saying, oh, this ain't f this family ain't what nobody try what nobody leaving there and not taking that baby but Jonathan Daddy. Okay, that's the only person who said he wasn't no babysitter. Now everybody who know me know I would have walked out of that motherfucker with my baby and treated that baby just like he was Jonathan like he was Jonathan himself. I ain't gonna lie, I would have gave him to Carlissa. But I will say Marsh probably is the better um candidate. Yeah. And when she came home, I would have handed her her baby back. I would have took her baby up there to visit her. I would have did whatever it take because I know how it feel to be locked up and, and, and wonder what's going on with your kids. So y'all on this internet making up all these type of different stories, hell to the no. We would not have left that baby in there. Me and Bree would have pat patted all night long until she got home. So that is not true. I don't like that the blogs, I've seen the on-site posts try to make it like I didn't want to take the baby. You should have played the whole recording, but guess what? My camera crew was there in the house and we recorded the entire thing. And you will hear everybody on the recording trying to figure out the best situation for the baby. Marsh pulled up, we locked eyes, we had a moment. I asked her, go in here and Wait for the court date. We'll ask the judge. Ask the judge what Jonathan wants to do with the baby since the mama not here. She said, I got to go. I got a hair appointment. She took the baby and she left. Now, if she called me tomorrow and say she need help with the I wouldn't want to be nowhere near him either. I, held, I would say the last time they was together, he put his hands on her butt. 
Apparently, they was kicking it after that. So, child, who knows? Baby, if you know me, you know I will pull up wherever she at, get my ass ten times, and help her with that baby. So all this, all part, listen, what, no, the, our family up, use a goddamn lie. Because I looked over at Jaden, and Jaden felt that too. And I do believe in my heart that she would have helped with that baby too. So stop saying we f***ed up because somebody didn't want to be no babysitter. I wouldn't have been no babysitter. I would have been the baby mama until the baby mama arrived. But I like how y'all love to try to spin it and play it like we so f***ed up. We in court about our child, whether we get along or not. Our child is grown. I'm in that mother in tears. Look be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So she had the baby. I didn't want to just snatch the baby from her. So I told Jonathan, Daddy, do not leave this baby sight to go get nothing. I don't care if you wet, need a bottle. You need, you need to take him with you. I ain't gonna lie. Grandparents are very important. Because I would have been with my grandma. But I mean, we are in different times. But damn. You the only person this baby know right now. So the, let this lady watch the baby for two seconds. I told him, no, hell no. That's why we started going back and forth. It wasn't like we just started arguing about the who gonna watch the baby. I'm telling him, I don't know the lady. I don't give a who the lady is. She might have just met the lady. I don't know. I said, don't leave this baby. Don't take your eyes off him. For any emergency, anything. And then he said Marsh was coming to get the baby. That's what Krishan wanted. We all agreed. If that's what she want her baby to go, I asked Marsh, please come into the courtroom and, and tell Jonathan what has happened and ask him if he wants you to take the baby home. Now, if he wants... What y'all think Blueface would have said? Comment down in the comment section below because ain't no telling. want us to take the baby home, then I'll take the baby home. And Marsh said, it's, it's okay, Miss Carlissa, I got the baby. I know some, I videoed the whole thing. My cameras was in, was rolling the whole time upstairs. So the way they tried to put it out, like we this horrible family, didn't nobody want to take the baby. That's a motherfucking lie, you know. Marsh will take good care of him, but Marsh's concern was going to get her hair done. And I didn't think that should have been the main focus at that moment. So when she said, I agree, but I don't think her main focus should have been sitting in court either. Said, I gotta go, I gotta go get my hair done. To get him to decide on something for a baby he ain't even taken care of, so. My, my mother. Honestly, Marsha's taking more care of him than uh, Blueface, so. Nature kicked in and said, whoa, 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 your bestie just went to jail. And, and we gotta figure something out with the baby and your hair gotta wait. So my, I just wanted Jonathan to let her know what he wanted to do, okay? Because sometimes, you know, the mom make a quick decision and it might not be the decision that the daddy want to make. It really wouldn't matter what, what he had to say. Like, y'all, I could, I could completely understand if he was the one taking care of, uh, of him and things like that. Not at all. I don't like the way y'all did that on site. Like, we didn't want to take the baby and we just a horrible family. You, I know you had more footage than what you put on there. I know I have rights before anybody in that motherfucking courtroom. And that, Definitely. That's why I was trying to exercise them. Once I realized that the daddy was not trying to take the baby home with him. But Marsh came in real fast like a flash of lightning. And I wasn't going to get get to arguing and fighting with, about nobody's baby in the courtroom. And, I, and that if I was her, I wouldn't have done that either. I know she loved Krishan and I know she loved the baby. She is the godmother. But that's why I asked her, let's go in here and let Jonathan tell us what he want to do since... We can, we can at least talk to him right now. Now, why the hell would you think that that would matter, Carlissa? And I know some of y'all are probably like, you know, he's the dad, it should matter. No, it shouldn't. Not if you're not taking care of him. So, no. The hell we got to ask Blue for? He probably... <laughs> what happened? Uh, Krishan in jail? Yeah. 
Give him to Marsh. Guarantee. He wouldn't have gave him to her. Didn't nobody say they didn't want to take the baby? Or he we wouldn't have gave him to his mom. Wasn't going to take the baby. Me and Jaden both looked at each other like, it's Jonathan, baby, so whatever we got to do to make sure that the baby is, is safe and don't feel this, I can guarantee you that was the look on both of our face. Right, I don't want to get no child charge, but I don't think I can get no child charge if our blood match. She know the laws any other time. Jonathan can do something. The judge could have let him speak on the child's behalf right there in the courtroom. If you got common sense, you know. He could have told the judge, my baby mama just went to jail. Can I give the baby to my mom or can I give the baby to my dad or I'm okay with the baby going with Marsh? Uh, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. It's just unfortunate because we knew that this was going to happen. That's why I kept saying to y'all, like, I mean, what if? Just, but what if, you know? And damn it. Bye.